Vampirella ran as fast as her long legs could carry her down the sterile white corridor, past the sealed cryo chambers that contained the last surviving members of Draculon, locked in hibernation, awaiting a new life on a new world. She did not dare look over her shoulder, for the soldier's thundering boots grew closer with every second. Her father had clawed his way out of the monster he had become long enough to save her life, and she was determined not to let his death be in vain. As she rounded a corner, Vampirella spotted a second group of soldiers headed towards her from the opposite direction. She came to a stop, planting herself in a battle stance. There would be no more running. It was time to fight or die. The two squads came to a halt within a few feet of her, eyeing the woman who had once been hailed as Draculon's savior. Luckily, the hallway was too tight for the soldiers to fire their blood rays without accidentally striking their comrades as well, which meant they'd have to fight hand in hand. That suited Vampirella just fine. Close quarters weapons, men, the squad leader barked. As one, the soldiers reached to their belts and unclipped riot batons, which, with a flick of the wrist, crackled with electricity. What's the matter, fellows? She jeered. Afraid you'll get your ass kicked by a girl? 